hello friends so we are going to write a program today we will we have to create a single link list with n nodes and then write a function to modify the link list so that all prime number in the link list will be appear in a one separate list and all composite number in the list will be in appear in the separate list okay so <coughs> what we will do is we will check every node and if we get a prime number then we will store it in a prime list otherwise we will store it in composite list okay so here we are declaring this node structure node okay uh, here node will, node is containing uh, integer variable num and the pointer variable next of struct node start type okay? and declaring these global variables pointer variables head prime and composite that head will point the main list prime will point to the uh, prime list and composite composite will point to the composite list okay so here it it is the create node function to create nodes okay this the size of the list will be um, passed as the argument okay? the size so <coughs> here what we are basically doing is we are performing a for loop okay for i is equal to 0 to i less than 1 okay? okay so the body will run exactly n times okay so here is the float uh, variable a to store the input uh, as, the, as it is given by the uh, user okay then we are uh, creating uh, okay allocating the space memory space of size of struct node okay so what will be the size of struct node it will be <coughs> the size of num integer variable num which is 4 by plus size of uh, pointer variable next this will be 8 byte okay so so malloc will uh, allocate memory space for uh, 12 bytes and return the address to the temp variable okay and then we uh, we take input from the user and store it in uh, this uh, temp dot null okay now and then the um, so we are using this if condition for the first time when head is null okay head is uh, storing null in it means the list is empty so this is for the uh, creating the first node okay and after that we are uh, appending the nodes so there will be no problem okay and uh, is prime this function as we have to check whether number is prime or not we are using this function is prime okay but we are doing here is sorry okay. so we are using this um, integer variable divisor to, uh, which will store the number of divisor okay so basically what we are doing in this we are assuming 1 and 0 as composite number okay so okay we are performing performing uh, for loop for integer i is equal to 2 to i less than or equal to a byte okay uh, if we get uh, if we didn't get any divisor between this number then the number should be prime number ok so if a percentage i means if the reminder is equal equal to 0 then the number has perfectly divided our number ok means we got a divisor then we have to we have to increase the divisor ok the divisor plus plus and we will immediately break the loop okay because we got a, a divisor then no 
no sense of performing this scuba diving okay and at the end of this loop we will uh, we will check whether device are equal equal to zero or not if device are equal equal to zero then we will return one for from one prime number okay prime number and if means if uh, divisor is not equal to zero means otherwise we will return zero for compose numbers okay so okay. this was all about the prime is prime function and we are moving ahead to the separate function okay which is our main function which will do the what we are what we are really want to do okay uh, that is fun this function will separate list as prime or composite okay so um, we here we are again performing the loop loop this time we are performing by loop this will <coughs> This will uh, run till PTR equal to null. Okay, means we go uh, reach the end of the list. Okay, so um, so we are checking if is prime equal equal to zero means whether the number is composite. Means uh, if this number is composite, then we are creating this composite list. Means this is for the first time. Where composite equal to null and otherwise, okay, ab abandoning the nodes. And if is prime equal equal to one means if the number is prime number, then we are implementing in the prime number list. Okay? And this is simply print list function. We are performing while loop until the uh, we reach the end of the list. Okay, and uh, printing the value one by one. Uh, okay, so uh, in the main function we have declared. Sorry, we have initialized head is equal to null, composite equal to null, and prime is equal to null. So we don't want any garbage value. Then in the end to store the size of the list given by the user. Okay. Taking input from the user here yeah, and creating node size of n and then printing list head okay the main list and separating <coughs> the main list by providing the address of the main list okay and here print f sorry and then printing the our two separate list prime list and composite list okay so we are running this. So how we run uh, C programming uh, command prompt? We write gcc dot sorry gcc space uh, set list dot c okay then dot slash n then press the tab button and then enter ok so here it is saying enter the size of the list so we are taking 6 and enter number so we are entering 17 19 5 4 3 and 1 so here prime numbers 17 19 5 and 3 and composite numbers are 4 and 9 ok so we have successfully executed our program okay thank you guys for watching this video